everybody, this is Dr. Aaron Leon Kennan, doctor of acupuncture and Chinese medicine with my practice in Alonge Food in Gush Etzion, about 30 minutes south of Jerusalem. And I'm going to be talking to you today about Mage. What is Mage? Mage is the Nahuatl slash Mexican name of uh, what we also call agave. You can hear that word also in Mexico. And I'm standing in front of Amage right now, and I'll be giving you more information about that and that name and where it comes from in a minute. But first, let's just take a look at some of these plants. All right, so this is a plant that's probably familiar to everyone. Um, in English, they're sometimes called sentry plants. My father called these things Flash Gordon plants because he said they could reach out and grab you like Flash Gordon. You can, you can see they have some pretty deadly spikes on them and if uh, sometimes people who have them growing on their property cut the ends off as you see here so that passers-by don't get dangerously stabbed and we're gonna walk around the corner a little bit here here's another one or two these are succulent desert plant type plants here's another one why are they called century plants well if you look up the center you'll see an asparagus looking blossom. This one's kind of up against what looks like a pine tree to me, so you can't really see much about what's going on with it, but that's the, the blossom. And what happens is these plants grow for years, and then they send up a blossom which lasts for many years. And then once that blossom is done, the whole plant dies off. And so they're called century plants because it lasts so long. It doesn't really last a century. I think it's more like 25 years. Um, but it gives people the impression that they, they last a century. Now, here is another similar looking plant that people might also call an agave, and I'll talk to you in a moment about the differences. Here we see a bunch of agave, or maguey, planted in a row. There's a really nice big one right there. 